Yo, yo, welcome to our video, guys. Honestly, today, uh, this is a rated R video. This is not family friendly. So make sure you get those headphones on or watch at a later time, right? Big disclaimer. But today, I was able to roast Zenial Gamer. Um, he is a, a content creator, he is a G3 player. And let's just say it wasn't easy, but big shout out to Zenial uh, for letting me roast his account and letting me turn it into a video. It is one of the perks for being a channel member and he uh, he redeemed it. So as a perk, you can either get an account review or an account roast. It doesn't even have to be your account. You get to pick. All right, let's get to it. We are going to start off. Let's see how many monsters we got. First of all, man. All right, so I'm not going to roast all of them or I'm not going to have a good roast for all of them. Obviously, you guys know that Senial Gamer is a pretty, pretty good player. Uh, he's not the best. That's why he's getting roasted right now. Because he's definitely not the best. And you can tell right here. Uh, this guy almost has more accuracy than fucking crit rate. Guys, have you guys ever seen an Aegir with more accuracy than crit rate? Because you almost see one right here. So, this Aegir. That means 46% of the fucking time he's not critting. The fuck is the point? You might as well just run crit rate on it. Or just go attack slot 4. I mean, honestly. 46% of the time. That's like half. It's like, oh, let me flip a coin. Do I want all of this wasted half of the time? Yes or no? Do we want this to be wasted? Oh, why not? Well, heads or tails, maybe all of these stats are wasted half of the time. All right, you know what? Annabelle. Annabelle, let's take a look. So, we got 31,000 HP. All right, not too bad. Honestly, there's not too much. She looks sexy. She's got the, she's got the beach or... What's that? Like the little girl outfit. So I'm not going to roast her. Instead, I'm going to roast you. Anyone that buys this, I guarantee you, you do, you probably do what I just did in your free time. So this is just a roast on you. You may have, um, let's just say, perverted thoughts. All right. Orion. Bro, Orion. Oh, man. Let me see. Is he on will? Oh, my God. This is a fucking snail Orion. This is a snail Orion. So, Snail Gamer is a G3 player. Uh, but his Orion is plus 181, not on Will. G3 players have a one not, plus 190 Orion on Will. 57% resistance on a Covenant. Because we don't want to run Will, right? God forbid. We want to take turn two. But... Again, we're flipping a coin. We have a 50% chance. We have a 50% chance that they can stun us. But honestly, if anything's going to stun us, it's going to be a 100% chance because they're going to have a lot of accuracy, right? But yeah, guys, new meta, guys. You know, 57% resistance on your Covenant. Uh, no will, all right? Rage and Dirt. And Dirt, guys. And Dirt Covenant might be the new meta. So this is his wannabe Fat Julie. <laughs> this is his wannabe Fat Julie. She couldn't clear a wave? Probably in, in Giants B7. I don't think even she can even clear shit. I, I don't think she can clear the wave. The very first wave in Giants B7. Definitely, girl, you gotta go to McDonald's. Sunil, please. Take this bitch to McDonald's twice a day and... Eight times on Sunday, all right? Beep her up, please. She's just not fat enough, bro. She's not fat enough. Oh, again, crit damage. Bro, we, we don't like crit damage substats, huh? We really don't. Amelia, 97% resistance. Just can't get that extra 3%, huh? Oh, bro. Okay, guys. I, no, I don't want to get Amelia to 100% resist, right? I want to get her an extra 12% attack instead. Okay, makes sense, guys. So, guys, start gemming your attack into Amelia's. Start gemming some attack into your Amelia's. Let her, you know, fuck getting 100%, right? It's just a game of, of odds, right? We don't want to see the nice red there. We'd rather have attack gem then. 12%. Not even like legends or anything, right? This shows, this is like blue fucking grinds. Because this is on Amelia, no, we want attack, all right? Look at that. Plus 530 attack. We would rather have the attack than, than, than max resist her. You know what? Your Theomars is legit. No roast there. You know, I mean, 
aside from uh, him having 10% more crit damage than, like, than your Stella, yeah, I don't think uh, Zenio likes, uh, I don't think Zenio likes uh, any crit damage. <laughs> that yo guys <laughs> all right so can we see a theme here we like an over 40 percent chance to miss the crit right and just lose out all of this is wasted when you don't crit but we also don't really like too much of this or maybe maybe that's the smart part maybe maybe he doesn't put enough crit damage so that when he flips the coin whether they're gonna crit or not that uh all this crit damage is not wasted because it's so little of it that that way it doesn't get wasted but bro seriously bro honestly you're better off running 100 percent crit rate on something and running 80 um or 50 just their base and stacking attack instead of missing a crit 40 percent of the time I, mean, I know she's violent so she's gonna get plenty of turns but yeah revenge huh okay I like that. That's the only good thing, honestly, about this Joseph thing. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> oh, man. This is Mina. Bro. Bro. Mina. All right, guys. Let me tell you something, okay? Her passive says she, her critical rate will be at 100% if the enemy has no harmful effects. She's a turn one monster. You guys see? He's got enough speed on her, running at about 260, right? So if every single time she hits, she's going to move first. She's going to crit. Why the fuck is she almost at minimum crit damage? What the fuck? Bro, he just does not like crit damage at all. Let's, let's, let's find out, okay? Eight. Eight crit damage in subs. Let's see how much more. Man, I think it's... Uh, we, we should have another... There it is. There's the five. There you go, guys. New meta for Mina. 13 crit damage and subs is all she needs, guys. Great fucking Mina there, guys. You don't want her to hit that. You know, you don't want to take advantage of her passive. I mean, then again, we, we, we've, we've noticed the trend, right? <laughs> we've got such low crit rate on his monsters and, and very low crit damage. So she's got 100% crit chance because of her passive. Nah, fuck that. We don't want crit damage, right? Oh my god. Fucking terrible Mina. Alright, so it looks like uh, we don't have enough crit rate on any monster. Oh my god, no accuracy either. So, what? The, why the fuck is he on crit damage? He can't defense break. He First of all, he's not even going to crit. Seriously. You might as well just make him a full support. Put him on triple fucking HP. Alright, so this girl. Oh, guys. Let me show you something. Removes all harmful effects, blah, blah, blah. The recovery amount is proportionate to the attack power. Oh, you know what? We don't want her healing. We rather stack HP and defense because we don't want her to heal. Ah, great Alunia. Oh, by the way, she's one of the best CC monsters in the game. Oh, <laughs> let's only throw 30% accuracy on her. <laughs> all right, we've got a Barbara. First of all, this Barbara. This is all I'm going to say, man. We really don't want her hitting. Uh, she should be in your fucking storage along with this shit. Oh my god, thank you for not having this ruin. Holy fuck. I, I probably would have stopped the roast right there, screenshot this, and probably used it as my next thumbnail and made a video out of, it, out of this. And probably the caption would have been the only G3 player who ever built this. I don't know. Thank you for not having runes on it because holy fuck. All right, guys, same same kind of uh, trend. 60% crit's all we want. Uh, no accuracy, can't land any heal blocks. Uh, sometimes it comes into play, but we know with this 143 crit damage, that's plenty. We're going to kill everything, right? Yo, Spectra, look at this. Uh, highest base speed in the game. That's actually base recorded on here. Not talking about the Dark uh, Hellhound, who is his passive that gives him extra. But you know what? We want plus 49 speed on that, bro. It's just so garbage. Look at this. Look at this. Plus 49 speed, right? He's got more crit rate and crit damage than most of his meta water monsters. 
Wow, let's just move on. Oh, another thing. Yo, guys, <laughs> another thing. I don't know how much this Kali hits for, but I'm guessing under 40k. Just garbage fucking crit damage, period. I don't give a shit what you say. I don't care how you're running it. This is garbage, garbage fucking crit damage, period. Period, period. Oh, look at that. I, I had to look over uh, to chat. So she, like I said, she hits her under 40k, 37.5. All right, Raccoonie. Yo, this Raccoonie, he's, a, uh, he, he's up there in crit damage. <laughs> this Raccoonie has more crit damage in subs than some of his other ones. Look at that. More crit damage in Oh, God. Okay, guys, we found his subs, uh, his crit damage subs. We found them. Uh, he puts them on Raccoonie. <laughs> okay guys this was not a roast this this was legit laughing i was not expecting this uh one of the best monsters in the game his passive is that every time he crits he basically gives your team almost another turn he's gonna give him 20 percent attack bar each turn um each time he hits he hits twice with each skill but <laughs> we don't want that we we want a chance to miss or better yet new meta maybe he made it as a miho counter maybe he brings it into mihos and he wants that five percent chance to win mm. basically the single most important monster in the game that needs a hundred percent crit rate we don't give it to him very fucking smart all right you know what i'm done with the crit rate uh honestly like i said at that point if you're under 60 what the fuck's the point of even having crit damage built you're going to miss 43% of the time. All of these stats are wasted. All of them. So you might as well just go attack there or HP and make her a fucking tank. Really? 57? If you can't get to 70, don't even try, bro. And what the fuck? All right, hold on, hold on. Let's take a look, all right? Let's take a look. Vanessa, amazing passive. Somebody gets killed, she brings it back. Skill 2, defense break, right? Skill 1? damage it does damage that's all it fucking dies if 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 you kill with this skill it will hit another target with skill two so let's take a look at Seniel's mindset here okay i want to make her tanky all right cool oh so he must make her really tanky to take advantage of this passive right wait no actually i want her damage oh all right so she's gonna have a shitload of attack right she's gonna have a shitload of crit that's why she's on crit damage, right? What the fuck? Well, no, she doesn't have enough crit. Well, how would she even set herself up? She's on violent, right? How did Vanessa's kill? S2 into a proc of S1, right? Oh, we can't fucking land the defense break. 15% accuracy? Fuck that, I'm done. That Vanessa's fucking trash. Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, guys, uh, let's put crit damage on Moretta and ignore his accuracy. Why the fuck do you even have this build? I'm despair. Crit damage? Really? 54 crit rate, guys. 54%. He doesn't even have multi-hits. So, when you run a unit that, that's that low on, on, uh, on crit rate, at least a lot of the times, they have multi-hits. Like a Fang, you know? He hits three times. Or whoever. Multi-hits, right? Yo, this thing hits once. This thing, single target, one hit. This thing, one hit. Never mind. I got it. I got it, guys. He probably opens with skill one, right? So that he uh, so that he can up his crit rate by 30%. The problem with that is, if he doesn't crit with it, you don't get that crit rate buff. I don't even know why the fuck he's ruined, but seriously? Crit damage? Really? 54? Ignore the accuracy. We don't want to land the dots. We don't want to land the turbulence. We'd rather just put crit down. All right, cool. All right. Maybe you know something I don't. Work on. All right, guys. Nine. Nine percent in crit damage substats. Okeanos. Bro. <laughs> oh, bro. I'm, I'm tired of just, I mean, this whole crit damage thing. We just don't like it, huh? We just don't like it. Uh, we just don't like crit damage. Okeanos, by the way, guys, 
he he should probably uh, if you use him he should have probably one of your fastest sets for Senio, and that's plus 167. Oh my god. Bro, bro. I didn't think I could roll something this bad, guys. Okay, guys, so this Freya, her sole purpose is basically to fucking die. And you can see from right here, you can see from her HP that he has her rune to die. Why the fuck does she have more crit rate than half of his other units? Wow. Okay, so we've got an 85. Oh, you know what? This is why you couldn't kill that Miho today in Siege. <sighs> Maybe drop some speed? If you're going to use him as a killer, make him a fucking killer. Why the fuck do you want so much speed on him? Seriously, where do you use him? You use him against Mihos, right? Mihos are usually with Orion. I mean, uh, with usually they're with Orion. So you're not even gonna get first turn anyway. Get him the fuck off of speed and put attack there. And get him on will for God's sake. What the fuck? Okay, same thing. 40% chance to miss a crit. And we don't want enough damage on that. 19 accuracy too. I mean, honestly, bro, just fucking put crit rate slot 4, drop the crit damage, and give him some ac accuracy so he can fucking defense break. And to stun, what the fuck is the point of, of him being able to revenge and stun when he's going to get resisted because he's got no accuracy? Bro, seriously? Guys, guys. One of the best units in the game. People are screaming for this guy to get on Earth. What the fuck? Is this shit? Will Blade Nemesis? Will Blade Nemesis. This guy thrives on violent. He thrives on violent. Bro, get him on fucking violent. Quit the bullshit. That's fucking garbage. What the fuck is Will Blade Nemesis? I, I'm not even gonna address him. You better get him on fucking violent. All right. All right, guys, try it. I'm not. I, I'm not looking. All right. I'm gonna cover the stats. I'm not looking at his stats, guys. Come on, G3 player, Trident. He's gotta be over 300 speed, right? That's the only way to ruin Trident. Period. Swift over 300 speed, right? All right. Let's take a look. <laughs> Holy fuck, bro! I, I'm sorry, man. I, I thought for sure. I, I thought he was gonna be close. I was thinking like 290 something. <laughs> Holy fuck. <laughs> Guys, guys, meta fucking monster for arena defense. Oh, not for Saniel. He'd rather put it on the spare wheel. Yeah. Awesome. One of the best strippers. The highest base speed of any stripper. Yeah, let's waste it. Let's put it on the spare. <laughs> Bro, come on. Mr. Optimizer himself prides himself in efficiency and everything. Why the fuck do you have 10 speed on him? Period. Why do you have 10 speed on him? And why does he not do any fucking damage? What the fuck? Guys, he would rather put crit damage on his Freya than on his fucking Leo. What the fuck is this? Seriously? Bro. Bro. Newsflash. This fucking skill ignores defense. Alright? This skill ignores defense. Take advantage of it. He does his job. Seriously though, get him to 100 if you're gonna fucking stack, go all the way. Go all the fucking way. What do you do? You buy a girl dinner, you undress her, and then as you get on top of her, you leave? Fucking finish. If you're stacking, do it. Let's go. Very decent, John. You need Will though. Fuck that. I expect better from you. Put Will on her. Unless she's running over 260 on violin, 255, you need Will, period. Well, no wonder. All right, guys, if you guys saw his stream today, he says Amarna is fucking useless. Same thing. Dude, fucking make up your mind. Are you going to use it as a support or as a fucking damage dealer? Newsflash, damage dealers need crit rate. If you're going to use crit damage, you need fucking crit rate. Yes, you're not going to glance. But that also means you're never going to have elemental advantage. You're not going to get the extra 15%. This guy legit will every single fucking time 
only have a 46% chance to crit. Make your mind up. Make him a support unit or make him a damage dealer. The fuck is this bullshit? Plus 17k HP? No wonder he fucking died when he got defense broken. This guy, plus 120. What's he got? Rage. Bro. Rage revenge. Ha. Ah. Bro. What the fuck? Rage revenge. Okay. Guys, we have a rage. Rage. A rage build. The purpose of rage is for this. The force it increases its crit damage by 40%. So you, what do you want to do? You want to stack crit damage when you're using this set, right? Nope, nope, nope. We're going to go attack slot 4, guys. Nah. We're going to go attack slot 4. We don't want more crit damage. Nope, nope. We cannot go past 140 crit damage. We have enough already between the set and the substats. That's it. We can't get more. No, no. We cannot get any more. We're going to put attack slot 4 on him. Because, no. it's Bro, seriously, what the fuck? Are you allergic to over 140 crit damage? Why the fuck are you even putting him on rage if you're not going to go crit damage? And the, you know what the funny thing is? He's actually got over 71 crit. One of the few monsters that you, that actually have 71 crit. Bro. Dova. Oh, I knew it. Rage. I'm sorry. Rage slot 6, right? But it's a swift build. So anybody, any G3 player that runs a Rage HP with a swift set, again, what does that mean? You're running broken. It means you have a shit ton of speed on that. It's not even fucking grinded for God's sake. Bro, plus 172? Plus 172. Dova, one of the best speed units in the game to pair with Illusion. Bro, seriously, get your ass in Giants already, bro. The fuck? We're almost guys. Speed, HP attack, 60% accuracy because we have to land that dot on skill one, right? Oh, bro, seriously. Even if you threw your 130 crit damage cap on him, I would definitely drop some accuracy for a 60. It's just way too much, bro. Get some more HP. If you feed support, just make him support. Let's take a look at the Miho. 240 speed, not bad. Hey, guys. Guys, all right, all right, all right, all right. Hey, let me show you something, all right? Let me show you something. So this Miho, this Miho, right? Her passive is every time she gets hit, she will counter attack. It will always be a crit, right? It will always be a crit. It doesn't matter how much crit rate you have. It's always going to crit, right? So, Samuel Gamer decides to give her... This might be probably like his eighth highest crit rate. This is probably like the eighth highest crit rate I've seen on his whole fucking account. A unit that already has built in 100% crit. Obviously, yes, it's only when she gets hit. But still, he gives her some of the most crit rate that he gives anything else? Really? Bro, take some crit rate off of this. Seriously, take some crit rate. Part of her mechanics are her revenging. That's what you want. So what do you want? You want every time that she hits to hit harder. Trade like 40 of this or 30 at least. Maybe even just 20. Whatever. But trade some of this for this. Or this. Attack or crit damage. Like what the fuck? She does not need this much fucking crit rate. Oh my god. Okay. Again, with the 130. Not bad. Not bad. So not only do you have 40% chance to miss a crit, but when you do, you're only going to hit... I mean, you got no attack. Why the fuck is he even on crit damage? Bro, you might as well take advantage of, 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 his, of his fucking passive and put him on triple HP, put him on despair, or speed HP HP. Get him faster. You want him cutting. Despair will is not bad. But seriously, bro, what the fuck? This is an LD unit. 40% of the time, you're not going to crit. This shit, while it's already shit, it's not enough. 40% of the time is going to get fucking wasted. And let's take a look. His precious LD Nat fucking 5. The bub. 86, 154. 
13 hundred attack. Hmm. Double nemesis will. Double nemesis will. Okay. So, I wonder why we didn't put him on rage or on violent. Because his. He himself says that this is garbage because you get to use it once and then it's three turns until it comes back and he can't use it again. So why the fuck is he not on violent? Let me just tell you something. I don't give a fuck whether he's good or bad. If he is your only LD, show him some fucking love. Show him some love. At least he's at 85 crit rate. Not bad. Not bad. And he's over 130. Not bad. But seriously, the fuck is the double nemesis going to do? What's Double Nemesis going to do? You have only plus 10k. You're still going to fucking die, most likely. And if you're still hitting like a Wenru, put him on 200 crit damage, 85 crit rate, violent. Period. End of story. Put him on that. Drop this shit. Bring someone to protect him so he doesn't get one shot. Bring the Triada. Drop this bullshit HP. Drop even some of this. You don't have anything to drop there, so you can drop your panties if you want. But add some more attack, put him on violent, put him on rage, and make him a fucking killing machine. Fuck. So there you have it, guys. Senio Gamer got roasted. If you didn't know, and now you know. <laughs> you know?